And also, man, don't go crazy, you know what I'm saying? These local countries, they have their own economy set up, you know what I'm saying? In some places, for instance, in the DR, you know, the average person pays between $100 and $200 a month for rent, you know what I'm saying? So if you, you know, Papi De Nero, you come down here, you know what I'm saying? You spending, you know, two, three hundred dollars on a female in a day, man, you just blowing things way out of proportion. You know what I'm saying? You messed up the economy, the local economy. So now, the next guy comes down, these women are gonna expect way more than you know, probably ever seen. I ain't gonna say deserve, you know what I'm saying? You can get what you can get out of life, you know what I'm saying? But he meant to say deserve. I, he meant to say deserve. You know, if you're an American man and you're not having the success you want as far as dating, you come to a foreign country and you have a lot more opportunity and access, you start to go crazy, that kind of throws things off, man. It makes an imbalance, if you will, in the force and the system. You know what I'm saying? Wait, instance, what? I posted a video about uh, what's going on in Sassua, Dominican Republic. A lot of guys going down there, treating the place like a strip club, you know, disrespectful, loud, throwing money around, you're upsetting the, the imbalance of things, you know. I didn't, I wasn't going down there in the 90s. I wasn't young enough, but I heard stories of guys going down there, you know, having a nice time with a young lady for 50 bucks or something, you know, for a couple of days. <laughs> you try to offer that to a young lady now, man, she's going to laugh in your face. Why? Because the local economy, the structure of things has been thrown off. You know what I'm saying? A lot of you guys going down there, going over there, acting crazy. Disrespecting the place, treating the place like it's Magic City or something, man. So you have to be careful. If you guys are going to these foreign countries and going down there wild and throwing money around, you are going to upset things and upset things to the point where now the women in these countries are going to start to turn into what you guys dislike about American women. They're going to have attitudes. They're going to want more money from you. They're going to expect a lot, a lot more from you than they usually did before because why? You guys upset the balance and the system. So be careful, man. Don't be going to these foreign countries. Balance and the system. You know, your eyes get big and you just go crazy. Because when you do that, you're going to upset things and things will never be the same like they were before. And Passport Bros. First off, before we like I really dive in, I want you to understand that this man is on vacation and he has a Dragon Ball Z shirt on. And he's giving you advice on women. This man is upset because it's gonna cost him more money to take advantage of poor people in another country. The fact that they're on the internet making it hot, every time I come across one of these videos, the first thing that go to my go through my mind is yeah, you ain't used to get no pussy. You ain't used to getting no pussy because the first rule of getting some cheeks is you don't kiss and tell. But when you have dudes who are lame at heart and they find a glitch in the matrix, they mess it up for everybody else. A lot of these dudes remind me of lame niggas I went to college with that happened to slip through the cracks with certain females. And then like after it's all said and done, the chick wished she could take the pussy back. It'd be one of them situations where when she come around and nigga, she'd walk with her head down and be like, damn, bro, I can't believe I fucked it. The energy I get when I look at a lot of these videos is a bunch of lame niggas that's trying to make themselves look cool. And that's why they talk about it so much. That's why they created a banner for it. We the passport bros. We, we partake in international prostitution. That's what it looked like to me. Now, I'm not knocking dudes that go to other countries and they end up falling in love. One of my mans, he, he went to Colombia and his... His girl, well, his, his fiance is Colombian. They have a child together. And here's the crazy part. He didn't even go over there for that. Oh, and might I add, he was going crazy over here. So it's not like he just some lame who couldn't get no play over here and decided to go to another country. You dudes is making excuses like American women are toxic and, you know, we want something better. No. American women know that you lame. So you got to go over there to where motherfuckers don't know you. That's like people that move from another state and create a whole new identity. The little money you waving around in DR, you feel me? The little money you waving around in Costa Rica, all them places where they kind of poor and shit like that. You can't wave that around over here. The whole Passport Bros movement is scumbag shit. Y'all ain't going to learn till they start killing y'all. Y'all think these so poor that they don't have the internet? You think they ain't going to know what's going on? Eventually...
This is going to start setting y'all up. Hey, you know what? They coming down here to fuck our women. We just wait for him at the airport, follow them to the Airbnb, stake his Airbnb out, stake his little apartment out, and see how much women he bringing in and out. All right, so now we know that's what you want. And now we on you. We're going to take your passport. We're going to take all your money, and we're going to leave you stranded. And you making it, y'all are making it bad for like me who probably just want to go over there and hang out. I go on vacation with my family and I go to the store to get some milk. And now one of these Dominican say, oh, he American. Oh, he, he probably one of the passport bros. Now I'm getting robbed because y'all making it hot. Y'all on the internet making it hot.